Yeah, I'd like to show what I've been working on uh, the last day or so. Um, I've actually fitted my Mimeo 1 with uh, 6800 processor and uh, fitted up the two-phase clock generator components. Uh, there's a chap on the net uh, called Eric Smith who uh, wrote a 6800 version of the monitor so I've burned the proms off that using my uh, trusty data IO programmer and um, I tried uh, just out of the box um, what you have to do is uh, break the 6502 links and fit in position C1 um, a 7404. I, I tried that, that didn't work. So um, after a bit of investigation I found there's actually two things you need to do to make this work. Firstly, uh, the 7404 um, is actually too fast to properly generate the correct specification two-phase clock. So what I've put in position here is actually uh, you probably can't see it very well, a 74L04 uh, which has a um, longer propagation time and that seems to uh, generate the correct clock. So uh, looking on the scope, uh, what we have here, the uh, white trace is phase 2 and the yellow trace is phase 1. So what you want is the phase 1 rising and falling within the uh, lower period of the uh, phase 2 clock and what I was finding with the 7404 rather than the 74L04 that the rising edge was correct but the falling edge would actually fall more or less with the rising edge of the clock and that was preventing it from working. Um, with that in place uh, it was working unreliably, I couldn't get it to reset properly. Once the uh, processor was reset uh, it often appeared to not be getting the correct reset vector from the ROM and uh, what I found was causing that was uh, pin 39 on the processor chip which is actually the uh, tri-state uh, enable I think it is on the uh, 6800 uh, was floating on the 6502 it's uh, not needed but on the 6800 you actually need to um, pull it low so what I've done is just put a uh, 10k resistor to ground on pin 39 and that seems to work. So um, let's see if we can actually get the monitor to go. As you can see, we've got the slash prompts, and I'll just try doing a bit of a memory dump, and there we go. So we have um, the 6800 version of the monitor running with the 6800 processor on the Apple One Mimeo hardware. Enjoy.